Hearing from Indiana Senator Todd Young, who met with the president to try to find common ground on a COVID relief bill. Young just wrapped up a video conference to discuss his meeting with the president last night. Now, while there was no compromise reached, Senator Young says their bill mirrors many components from President Biden's plan. That includes increased funding for vaccines, economic relief for Americans in need, and extending federal unemployment benefits. Some of the major differences in the plans are the stimulus payments. Biden's plan would give $1,400 in direct payments. The GOP plan would give $1,000 to people making under $40,000 a year. The GOP plan also does not include a boost to the minimum wage and gives less relief to schools trying to reopen. Despite these differences, Senator Young says actions on previous relief efforts prove that there can be bipartisanship in the effort. In the wake of an inaugural address, and the theme was unity, one would hope that we could come together once again on a bipartisan measure to kick off this administration and really turn that, um, turn that language of, of unity into uh, real unified action. Democrats would need support from 10 Republicans to pass their $1.9 trillion plan. Senator Young says talks between their group and the administration are expected to continue.